Is everyone ready for episode two of Reap What You Sow? Boom. Uh, did I? Is there? There's no. No. Okay. Thought I had more controls for a second. This is controller compatible. <laughs> Fuck. Bravo, man. Good job. I don't think I've seen one of these yet that have been uh, compatible with etc. All right. So I've got a plan now. Okay. I okay. Like, being real here, I have a plan this time. I'm gonna water everything beforehand so I don't have to run around while I got skeletons chasing me. You feel me? Oh, wow, you're smart. What? I said, oh, wow, you're smart. Yes, and to answer your question, I am still going to plant all those skeletons. Oh, uh, fucking course you are. God damn it, Knightson. Yes. Can I just... Can you? Can I? <laughs> can you what? Can I just not be here? Ah, <laughs> uh, I mean... Can I just fade out of existence <laughs> right now and just not be checked in for any of this? I mean, in theory, yes, one could. And you are one. Well, I, I haven't even used growth potions yet. I don't know what they do. Hold the button to what? Over dry soil to make it not dry. Okay. Get some fucking water. Is that pro? Wait, is this a... I <sighs> got one. Just one random ass little spot. You didn't notice that last time? No, I... Oh, the other little random ass spot? I didn't notice that either. Yes, you did. You watered it. Did I? You made an effort to. I... While skeletons were chasing you. We did not do anything of the sort. Whatever. Alright, anyway. Anywho. Back with Report You Sew because we didn't do enough last time. There's so much. Oh, so much to do. I've got... Wait. One spot left? And I got a little spot. Cool. Uh... Where's my corn? Corn, 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 corn. Corn. You're a fuckboy. And, uh... You're a fuckboy. I'm gonna go get some skeletons pissed at me. <laughs> Welcome back to Oni Shooking Gaming, where Nathan is the most important person. Welcome to Two and a Half Minutes In, and Nathan finally kicks in his opening song. <laughs> uh, you no, hit it. I actually know how to open that. You hit it. <clears throat> I think that's what you do. I, oh God, I hate your cat. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna tell a story. Okay. I'm gonna tell a story of how I got hired. All right, please do, cause I've been trying to recount it for people and I've been unable to. Okay, so <clears throat> is it okay if I use the restaurant name? Uh, yeah, sure. I'll yeah, switch yeah, it yeah, up. Yeah, yeah. No, no, no. You, no, it's fine. You, no, use no. it, cause I love that restaurant. Okay. So I applied for Steak and Shake as a waiter. Yeah. Hella awesome at being a waiter, by the way. Okay, so. I hear that. From I hate, you. I hate that place. <laughs> Do you hate that place? Like, like the... I like it and I hate it all at the same time. The people... This one, right the... there. Like, I don't want to say anything, just in case. <laughs> there have been people that have been problems. Yeah. Is that, that's, that's that, that sums it, it up. That sums it up. Not the customers. Love the customers. Most of them. But yeah, so during the application process, I come in, I sit down, and uh, yawn break. Yawn. Mm. Yawn. Oh, <laughs> I thought you were saying like y'all on break in like a weird country accent. Y'all like, like, on you're, break. You're like staggered back for like some Y'all on break. Y'all on break. I'm like, I'm supposed to pause right now? What the fuck do you want from me? So I walk in and like completely unprofessional, casual interview, by the what way. What am I supposed to do? The, the manager who is supposed to be interviewing me is running back and forth between the counter and the register, talking to me and then talking uh. to customers. And as soon as I walk in, I walk in with my girlfriend and my friend, and uh, super unprofessional. Super unprofessional. Just to prove a point here, though, this is how awesome I am at being interviewed. Being interviewed. Um, oh, hey, they were coming for me. Sweet. So I walk in, and he's like, "Which one am I supposed to be interviewing right now? The guy with the beard?" And he points to my buddy. I'm like, "No, man, it's totally me." Uh, he's like, "Oh God, you sweet. you just look like the type of dude who I need to hit in the face." Like super professional, <laughs> super professional. He's like, y you just have that face that just needs to be hit. And then he goes up and starts talking uh, to uh, 
What? You can hit those and get more? No, I think I harvested them out of the ground. Yeah, but then you got three for one. I don't think I did. Yeah, no, I, I, I killed three, and then they respawned. Oh, okay, three. got okay. it. Well, I walk in, and he starts talking about my face and how you know, it needs I, to be I, hit. I can't disagree with him. Shut the fuck up. But he starts talking about my face and how okay. it needs to be hit. Look at how... No one needs to come in this area. There's so many goddamn traffic cones. <laughs> Blocked off. Yeah, it won't. Um, proceeds to go back over to the counter to talk to some customers and asks them if I have that face that just <laughs> needs to be hit. Excuse me, I know you're uh, you're you're here to dine with us today, but I have to ask you an important question. Do you want to punch this fucker directly in his fat face? Doesn't he just look like that kind of guy Doesn't who he... needs to just... He looks like someone who's had it too good for too fucking long, and he just needs this. Exactly. And, uh... I failed to mention that before this interview, I had grabbed one of the paper toy cars that they have in the, uh, in the front that they give to... You make it very hard to. I, st I I'm good for your stories. I'm no, nice. You're not. I listen. No, you don't. This is exactly what you do during my stories. Anyway, I grabbed one of those paper cars I that listening. they they build and they give kids to build. And I'm building this during the interview, and we're just running over a bunch of shit like. Uh, ah! Thing <laughs> I forgot how many I planted. <laughs> like things that I like to do. Um. Which uh, is pretty much just, I was like, I play magic, and he wrote that down. I was like, okay, I'm a people person. He's like, oh, I fucking hate that word. People person. I, I just... Ugh. Which I can sympathize. I hate people. I hate when people say they're down to earth. So I proceeded to say it that seven more times, so he wrote down people person times seven. <laughs> um, I said that I like cats. He decided to write that down. Very professional interview, mind you. Like, he's getting all of my best features, like... On paper. Nathan likes card games and cats. That people person, people person, people person, people person, people person, people person, people person. People person. <laughs> Write that down, and I could transmute you into existence. <laughs> so you know, I, I do that, and uh, all in all, he just tells me that none of it meant anything because I was hired anyway. I just had to not be an idiot. So it's just a fun little conversation that I had while building a toy car and not telling him shit. Good time. Good time. Good. Yeah, it was fun. God, I hate that place, though. <laughs> I love Steak and Shake. It is perhaps one, ah, one of my favorite restaurants. Oh, no, it's a great restaurant. I love eating there. Oh, fuck, I was trying to eat them. Kill them skeleton science. I'm working on it. I just love them so. I fucking forgot which button the attack button was. <laughs> Good job, it's Z. I know, but I mix up X and Z. Boom, this is like, not even, not even. No, it's not hard at all, you're just bad. <laughs> I was totally gonna say something. Um, what was I gonna say? Did you God. suck at this? What was I gonna say? Are you gonna plant 99 skeletons and kill them? But a bitch ain't one. I'll be back in just a second. You know what, I'll get the broth first, how about that? All right, progress. I wanna know what the broth is. And then I'll plant 99 skeletons. We've been waiting for this. But a bitch ain't one. Got 99 skeletons. Uh, this way, I think. And then this way, and then over here, and then... Boom! What do you do? I, I, I... <gasps> Did he give you a super scythe? Oh my god! Oh, wow! I opened up more of the game and crashed it again. <laughs> god <laughs> <laughs> oh come on, dude! Ugh. Wait, can I? I can click it this time, and I still broke it. All right, we are experiencing technical difficulties. <laughs> <laughs> we are experiencing oh, technical back. difficulties right in back. speech and best be right back in. I actually need this. I need to explore. Are we recording? Y yes, we're. We are. I mean, yeah, for sure. <laughs> Whatever. Well, who fucking cares? I'm just playing this game. <laughs> um. So, I had never been to Steak and Shake, right? And then one day, uh, me and Mike were... Story time? Yeah, yeah, story time. Me and Mike were in a... <laughs> story time and just immediately <laughs> go for the phone, right? <laughs> um, me and Mike were in St. Louis, right? And uh, right across from the venue, because we were playing Yu-Gi-Oh up there. Right across from the venue... 
you get home? Uh, right across from the venue, there was a steak and shake, and I had never been there. And I was just like, whatever, Mike, I'll, you know, hang out with you. And he ordered a garlic steak burger. And he was like, well, this is the most disgusting thing I think I've ever had at, like, a fast food restaurant. I can't eat it. And I'm like, really? It's, like, my favorite thing. Can I have it? And he's like, yeah, absolutely. I do not want this. And then I, you know, I tried it, and I'm like... Get that fucking ruby. This is literally the best thing I've had at a fast food restaurant can I have two more of these, please? Uh huh. No, that was it. I then I ate them. And oh. I, so I had like two and a half of those burgers. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> and I, I I love it. How did you find out about the seven of seven? Uh, all right. So we were at another Yu-Gi-Oh event, and hold on, the seven of seven is seven of these put together. Oh, dude. Yeah. No, it's it is. It is a hidden menu item, yeah. much like any restaurant has. Fact. See, fast food fuck, restaurants fuck, fuck, are fuck. kind of like video games. If you hit up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right, BA start, you can get some interesting things. Absolutely. And boom, if you look boom, in tips boom. and tricks, you know, have them in there. They, they can tell you about the <laughs> the different food items on McDonald's menu. <laughs> That's what I subscribe to tips and tricks for. <laughs> fast food <laughs> advice. But 7 of 7. Uh, yeah, so it is a, it's, um, uh, a burger. A big burger. <laughs> yeah, it's a... Uh, Alright, so usually, like, the garlic steak burgers well are, like, for, we're totally fucking advertising here. I don't care. I love Steak and Shake. Uh, it's like... They're not paying us for this. I wish. That'd be gnarly. It's like four bucks normally. Jeez, that stuff's still there. Yeah, you didn't grab it. What? Stop distracting me with the rubies. <laughs> this was after the ruby. <laughs> uh, oh, fuck. I'm, I'm so fucking lost right now in what I'm doing. Um, You're planting skeletons. I know what I'm actually doing. Um, I need health. Oh. Yeah, so it's normally like four bucks a piece for the sand for the sandwiches, and then it was like uh, it's seven dollars and seventy-seven cents for. Oh, fuck those! I don't, I don't need that one. Seven dollars and seventy-seven cents for seven patties and seven pieces of cheese stacked on top of each other. Which is like the craziest thing. Which is actually the cheapest way to get it too, turns yeah, out. Because like, to add a patty to something is a buck fifty. Which is like it's crazy. And I, I like always thought it was secret, and I walked into like a steak and shake one day and there was like five people eating it. And I was like How did you all know about this? How is this profit? Hey, cat. Fuck off. Nathan said, don't just randomly Talk about your cats, because nobody can see the cat. No, I'm and threatening the cat. That wasn't a threat, you just said cat. It knows what I'm going to do. Cat! To it. I'm pointing at you. It knows what I'm going to do to it. Jump. Uh, yeah, but Jump, we, were, girl. we were at an event, and we went to Steak and Shake, and I had not eat. I had didn't eat Friday, and then I pulled an all-nighter, uh, and then didn't eat the entire time we were there on Saturday, and then it was like midnight, we were heading back, and I just could not exist anymore uh and I, I came in and I, I was joking to the the waiter like i'm gonna eat like seven eight burgers tonight he's like well just so you know there's an army coming for you <laughs> fuck i forgot what button was attack again he's like just so you know there's this item it's not on the menu and i'm like oh you've got me already what what's going on with this it's like oh it's called seven on seven it is seven patties and seven pieces of cheese and i'm like can i add garlic to that yeah, here. <laughs> Lucky like, for you. Yes, you absolutely can. I left him like, I think, I swear I left him like a $10, $15 tip. It was like one of the best waiters I've ever had. Because he was just super helpful, super awesome all night. Wow. When are you going to come in and give me a tip? I won't. <laughs> when are you going to pay me back my money? <laughs> when you come in and give me a tip? I will give you a $2 tip and you pay me back the money that you owe me. He will give me a $2 tip and I shall pay you $2 towards my tip. Or towards my money that I owe you. Boom, 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 boom. <laughs> boom, 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 boom. Weren't you immediately going to go get that awesome scythe? Uh, shit. <laughs> Look, man. All right. <laughs> Don't fuck it. <laughs> I got shit on my, on my mind, all right? I'm thinking like, about delicious, delicious steak and shake. Does this hurt me? No. Um. You only have two health. 
Boom, boom, traffic cones of victory. Um, what, what the fuck? Where was I in the story? Yeah, okay, so I ate yeah, that whole him. thing, and I uh, couldn't tell if it was the fact that I had just eaten, like, 12 pounds of meat or that uh, I was asleep, but I, I lost, like, all motor functions for a while and uh, just <laughs> really was not doing well. I was, like, losing sight. And I couldn't tell if it was because I was passing out or having a heart attack. I think it was the former. Ah! 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 Wait, it's another glitch. Alright, look. Realistically here, this game's great. And it was made for the GB Jam thing. Um, which is definitely, you know, this a hurried thing. But we're running into some bugs here. A lot. So I'm not sure how easy this is going to be. We'll, we'll we'll cut in some stuff perhaps later. Well, we're, we might I might retouch on this one. But anyway. <laughs> fuck it. Indeed, fuck it for now. I love this game. It looks like a lot of fun. It's great, dude. Anyway. Microwaves. Bye, everybody. Bye. Did you just say microwaves? Microwave.